His passion is all-encompassing. He's a very, very focused, very loyal person. Washu has been his life. You know, it's not a job. It's what you do and breathe and live and laugh. He was all about excellence. And it seemed like every time I would hear him speak in, in so many different venues, at some point, excellence would surface. His consistency and being uh, present uh, at games uh, for our student athletes. And in this type of environment, and one of the things we hang our hats on is the fact that we have uh, a lot of people here that really care about our young people and their development. He loved to engage with the students. And he would be at every home game possible. That was probably the only time that he wasn't thinking about work. This was his fun. He definitely had a passion for, uh, for the athletes, for the sports. Uh, he was all about excellence. I think our, our students felt that. To see that happen from top leadership uh, really sends a message, not only to our coaches, not only to our student athletes, but also uh, about our program. No one cherished uh, uh, that moment more in our Founders Cup game than, than Mark. Uh, he was always down with the players. Uh, the players knew that he'd be down there. They talked about it the day before the game. Let's win this game and get Mark Wright involved and uh, not only embrace the trophy, but to hoist it up. And I, I know that was special to him. He was very proud about um, being able to develop the Summers Recreation Center. Mark was instrumental in, in keeping that idea afloat for many years, saying that this is important on our campus. Seeing him at, you know, sack night, talking to our young people prior to them going into exam week, uh, as well as being there in the postseason supporting our young people. When you think about all the things that's on his plate, um, he lives it through action. I see Mark Wrighton as the guy sitting in the press box on a, a cold November playoff uh, time where he's watching a Maggie or a, a Lizzie kick a ball and at the same time on another computer watching our volleyball team uh, playing two or three hundred miles away. The exciting thing for most Saturday afternoons at Washington University, uh, Mark would be at the game. I knew that I wasn't the only guy in the stadium that would have a tie on. One of the things I appreciated is the fact that everything he said as far as how he saw athletics and his role at this uh, top-notch institution was something that he lived uh, through his action. Mark is just passionate about anything Wash U. And then athletics was extra special. The fact that you recognize that he was at the home games and he really cared about the performance, um, I think he was surprised and probably this is one of the more thrilling accolades that he's had. He wasn't a man of, of great big stature, but you know he's a giant in our history at Washington University.